Hi everyone. This is a quick video on how to find the closest integer point. So I'll go ahead and add a graph page. And let's say I type in two equations from uh, my portfolio. So we'll see that this is one of my constraints. I'll go ahead and push enter. Try to graph this. Okay, not showing up yet. And you'll see that this is another one of my constraints. And I'll push enter. I see some lines, but I'm going to have to adjust the window. And this is the window I'm going to try. I want you to note, in order to do this, you make, need to make the X scale and Y scale 1. Now I've done the graph, and this is what it looks like. Let's go ahead and find the intersection. And here is the point of intersection. So let's say I need to find the closest integer point to this point. And let's say in my portfolio, my region, part of my region is uh, right around in this area, let's say. So I'll go ahead and move this label out. All right. How do you find the closest integer point? All right. So what we'll do is we'll go menu, view, grid, dot grid. All right, we'll put a dot grid in there and we want to uh, analyze this area. So let me uh, zoom in a little bit. So I'll go to zoom in, click on my point. Okay, that looks pretty good. So we'll try to find the closest integer point. Okay, um, we'll go ahead and put a point on the function. We'll go to geometry, points and lines, point on. I'll put it somewhere on one of these dots in the grid. Now, it won't tell me what the coordinate is, so let me go to Actions, Coordinates and Equations, double-click on this, and there we go. Now, that's not the closest integer point, uh, so let me grab this, and, uh, well, first let me escape. All right, see if I can move it closer. And right there, the point 311, that would be the closest integer point. Doesn't look like there's any more. Now, sometimes these points can be on the line, or you can have more than one inside the region. But that's how you find the closest integer point, and that's the point you want to put in the objective function. Thanks, guys. If you have any questions, please come see me.